In the proof-of-work model, a node publishes the next block by being the first to solve a computationally intensive puzzle. These nodes are also called miners, and they solve the puzzle by randomly trying. The puzzle is asymmetrical. So that means that it is designed such that the puzzle is difficult to solve, but it is easy to validate the solution. So this enables all other full nodes to easily check if the found solution is the correct one. So the solution to this puzzle is the proof they have performed their work. And the first miner who solves the puzzle gets a coin as a reward for the work he has done. So blockchains like Bitcoin uses proof of work as a consensus mechanism. So proof of work secures the network and prevents cheating. As a result, you can trust the network and don't have to worry about fraud. So a common puzzle method is to require that the hash digits of a block header have to be less than a target value. So, publishing nodes make many small changes to their block header, trying to find a hash digest that meets the requirement. For each attempt, the publishing node must compute the hash for the entire block header. Hashing the block header many times becomes a computationally intensive process. Therefore, the target value may be modified over time, to adjust the difficulty to influence how often blocks are being published. An important aspect of this model is, that the work put into a puzzle does not influence one's likelihood of solving the current or future puzzles, because the puzzles are independent of each other. So every puzzle is completely different and they have nothing in common. They also have to watch out for new validated blocks. So imagine a miner, who is currently working on his block and tries to validate it. Now he receives a completed and valid block from another user. So he is now incentivized to discard his current work, and has to start to build a new block based on the new received block. This happens because they know, that the other publishing nodes will also build their blocks on top of the new one. As a result, the miners create a chain of connected blocks. However, this process requires a ton of computing power. Proof of works gives more rewards to people with better equipment and connection. This means if your hash rate is higher, you have a better chance to be the first one that solves the mathematical puzzle. This leads to a situation where people are building huge mining farms. Miners come together to push their chances even further to mining pools. All miners of the pools then receive an equal reward. So this is causing the blockchain to become more centralized. Therefore we need to find a better way to validate transactions.